Now let's take a look at the price and output determination. We've done price and output determination in other markets like the perfect competition, the monopoly, the monopolistic competition. However, such price and output determination, the equilibrium determination is not possible in oligopoly. Now why is price and output determination not possible in oligopoly? It's because the oligopolistic market is interdependent on the sellers. The sellers are interdependent on themselves rather. Their policies are based on the policies of the competitors. Their actions and reactions are based on the actions and reactions of the competitors. So a firm would never be sure as to what would be its demand curve what would be its marginal revenue curve and when the firm is not sure what is its average revenue marginal revenue or demand curve it can never come out with an optimum production or the least cost production so in an oligopolistic market we cannot fix the price or we cannot bring out the optimum output so we can say that price cannot be fixed by economy by whatever methods of economic analysis you try to find out you will never be able to find out the exact demand curve of the firm under oligopolistic competition you will never be able to find out the average or the marginal revenue curve of the firm under oligopolistic competition so you'll never be sure about it. If you're never sure about demand curve, you do not know how your marginal or average revenue curve would be like. You can never set the price or the optimum output or the quantity that you should produce in an oligopoly by any economic analysis.